Crazy Mike from CrazyMikesApps.com with an iPhone accessory review for the Shark Eye case, which is a rugged case which was sent to me by SharkEye.com. They uh, sent me over a case to ch test out and to do a review for, so that is what I am doing. It's a very nice case. It's a rugged case, and I've already tested out. I haven't done a review for I've already tested out the OtterBox and the Sideo rugged cases, and this one is right up there. Actually, it's probably a little bit better than the OtterBox in the sense that I had to actually customize my OtterBox case by ripping off the screen because I didn't like the touch screen that came with it, the cover for it. Let's look at what the Shark Guy gives us. This is the case it came in, and uh, by the way, I will link to SharkEye.com so you can check this out. This is a $49 case. Here is the case itself, and it's a little bit of a difference for it, uh, something special that you're going to see that I think you'll find unique. Here is the holster clip, so you can have it either landscape or portrait mode while you're walking with it. Here's my iPhone 4. They do have iPhone 3GS cases. We snap it in there, push it in, fits snugly as you can see. That's the special part I'll be getting to. It's got a cutout for my camera as you can see. And then I'm going to go ahead and attach the bottom portion by sliding this in here. And it's, it will snap and it's fairly easy to do. As you can see, there you are. Snap together. Now remember this is a rugged case so this is not, um, this is not, you know, a, a simple somewhat protective case as you can see there the buttons work I don't have anything on there it did come with screen protectors but I didn't choose to put one on because I'm not a big fan of those for anything but it has this thing which is very cool you can either use it and push it off manually like that but you have a screen protector that you can slide over so if you can look real close again you can see that little screen pops over and actually you can use your finger there and that's probably the correct way to use it that I'm not using. Um, you can use this, the sleep mode, the buttons here to uh, change the volume once you slide in. Yeah, you know, you all know my code by now. Ooh, one more time and I'm gonna be out of it. So you can see the, the buttons easily work. You know, it is a little difficult to get to the the silent button, but as you can see, I can stick my finger in there and manipulate it. I got fat fingers, but it does work. That is the Shark Eye case. Again, here is the uh, the case to snap it in, and it snaps in like that. You can have it again in portrait or landscape on your belt clip. So, and it, the one thing I do like about this case is it's got this, and that is something that the OtterBox was a passion of mine. It had two clips and it took two hands to get it out. This one pops right out with one hand which is beautiful and then I can open up my screen there and you don't even have to use that back screen if you don't want to. It's entirely up to you. Again, comes in different colors here. I got green sent to me which, you know, green's cool. Down at the bottom it does have a protective cover for your uh, pin, your 30 pin. So it's got everything you want in a rugged case. The only thing I didn't do with this is throw my phone to the ground. So I'm not going to. Um, I've already been the unfortunate recipient of smashing my screen on another iPhone that I had. So um, I'm going to skip that portion of it. But uh, Shark Eye case, rugged, and I believe this. I believe if I would have had this on because there's a nice little lip here. I would not have broke my screen. Matter of fact, I know I wouldn't have broke it. That is the whole point. Uh, and this is a really tough case. There's no looseness about it. You can't feel any shaking, which I have felt with, unfortunately, the Sideo case. So um, pros and cons of carrying a heavy case or a, a case like this is that um, it is bulkier. That's the biggest drawback to a big case. But that is the Shark Eye uh, case Again, forty nine ninety five. There'll be a link to it in the description for this uh, iPhone accessory review. Until next time, this has been Crazy Mike from Crazy Mike's App saying, "See ya."